Yo, what's going on guys? JBH here and today I'm back on R Factor 2 where we are back in the IndyCar series once again. Now last time out I won the biggest race in the IndyCar calendar, the Indy 500. Not without a little bit of luck I must admit, um, but yeah for the most part on the road course side of things we've been pretty poor this season. I've DNF to the first two races uh, that I set out to do at Barber and the Indy GP. Whereas today we are heading to the one and only street circuit that I will be competing on this year. Well, actually, if I can manage to get a good Toronto sort of mod, then we might do that one as well. But yeah, besides that, this is the only street circuit as of right now. Um, now, I really do like Detroit Belle Isle. It is an awesome track. It's incredibly narrow. It's inc uh, incredibly sort of tight and twisty. There's a lot of different types of corners um, however so far in practice I've got a pretty good setup together so I'm going to go do a quick qualifying session here in a sec and hopefully get this Penske car as far up the grid as possible now there are actually two races in the Detroit sort of Grand Prix that they run each year in the IndyCar series it's called the du Duel in Detroit I believe or Duel in Detroit if you're American um, so you have one race on Saturday one race on Sunday however we're just going to be doing one race today but anyway that's enough talk let's get into this video Okay, so that's qualifying run and done. Managed to put it in the fence again. Uh, it's not the first time I've done that in qualifying this year. However, up until that point, we were looking pretty quick. So I'm pretty happy about our pace and the handling of this Penske Chevy. I did actually try a couple things in practice that I haven't tried so far this year on this mod. And it definitely made the car a lot quicker. So I'm really happy with how it's balanced. Uh, 35 laps is the race distance. So half what it is in real life. I think we're going to have to make two pit stops. However, I'm not entirely sure what the sort of tire wear and fuel consumption is over a full run which we'll soon find out also with cautions and whatnot you never know uh, what the strategy is going to be on a street circuit in the IndyCar series whether it be in real life or on our factor two is a rolling start of course in the IndyCar series so we'll just skip through this quickly alrighty here we go Detroit Bell Isle on our factor two in the IndyCar series oh AI's got full retard uh, three wide does not work around turn one Woo. Around the outside over the rise. Alright, now down this mini straightaway before it all gets unstuck into this right hander. This is a heavy braking zone with a lot of cars trying to fit through it. Ooh, squeeze. Uh, just about <laughs> climbed our way over that curb. Oh, uh, no. Uh, come on. The AI are a little bit uh, sketchy around here, I must admit. Compared to other tracks, it is a street circuit, so... The street circuits, RFX2, AI just don't always cooperate. Oh, you climbed that curd, bud. <laughs> uh, we just got to get through this first couple of laps without losing any body work. And we should be alright. Uh, quite good through this final sector. It's the first sector where I seem to struggle. Oh, cold tyres first lap. Oh, spinner. Oh, big wreck. Come on. <laughs> Free spots. Ah, uh, come on. Oh, <laughs> just came into contact with some behind us. Any contact through that turn one and shit goes down. Uh, so many cars have ended up in that turn one outside fence over the years around this place. Come on, frame rate. Uh, bruh, driving like trash. not used to this full fuel load and a uh, cold set of tyres. That should be up to temperature and pressure now, but uh, that first lap was sketchy. I'm just scared to the pass the AI because I feel like I'm going to pluck a front wing or end up in a front somewhere. Come on. Right, lap two is in the books. We got Max Chilton. It's 
not going too hard out right now. Don't want to make any major mistakes. It's going to cost us. Oh, <laughs> two wheel that bad boy. You. Up the inside. Don't mind if I do. That's another spot. It definitely is my place to pass right now. I don't know why the AI breaks so early going into that very sharp right hander. Come on, frame rate. I don't know why the FPS has been really weird around this track. Well, it was fine in the uh, IMSA race yesterday, but not liking these Indy cars. Oh. They do tend to keep hitting that inside wall as well. Really struggling to get out of that right hander. Nah. And the curbs are just so tall around here, you can't really touch any of them. It really screws you over. Twenty-five seconds behind the lead, it's spending too much time battling with these guys at the back. we got left in this stint so yeah around 13 no 12 laps fuel oh okay bang that's right still think we have a front wing they just break so early through there I can't get used to it
Just got to get a good run through turn one and try and get him into that heavy braking zone. Problem is the aero wash. Oh, yuck. Sort it out. Oh, big dive bump. Can't get past this guy. We're looking on ties. Not too bad. that bump is. So hard to pass around here. Can't get close enough to make a move. Whew, it's hot. Gotta get it done on this lap. Oh, no, no, no. Okay, that's. <laughs> it's one way of doing it. <laughs> Just back her in sideways. Yeah, but I'm out of the way. No worries. Come on. No, 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 ah, got to be joking me, absolute idiot, ah, oh, actually I think we've got away with that somehow, no, I think we've lost, yeah, no, we're going to have to hit, god damn it, I don't know what happened there, just got all sorts of loose off of that bloody right-hander, anyway, that's, 
Gonna cost us a lot of time. An idiot. Alright, first pit stop's coming way earlier than what it should be because we've got some damage to fix, but... Oh man, screwed up again. I just can't go a lap down, cannot go a lap down. Come on, get me out. There's the leaders. Is that the leader? Is that? I think that's actually never mind. Whoa, hello. Yep. Ah, oh, get back on the track, you knob. I did not need that. Really did not want to go a lap down and let these guys go by. It's just gonna be a massive pain in the ass. Uh, it's all gone to shit. All gone to shit. After so much success at Indy, it's all gone to shit. Alright, well, everyone on the lead lap has actually just gone into the pit, so that'll give us our lap back. Alright, now we've got some space. Let's just try and put some good laps together and see if we can make some time back. Piece of shit. Honest to fucking God. Frame rate so bad. Right, I can't believe we're fighting for like seventeenth spot. Something has happened there. Man, I'm sweating like a pig in here. It's, well, we're up to 14, so something's happened and 
gained a couple of spots. Man, I don't know what is going on with this frame rate. I think I've actually got it too high. Just noticed in the top right corner it's saying like 120, 130, so I reckon it's skipping frames because we've got it set too high. I should have capped it before we got into the race, but anyway, it is what it is. Too late now. And these front tyres are really starting to complain now. Uh, Alright, so we've got just about 10 laps, few, uh, 10 laps left, so... Someone's had a bit of a mess there. <laughs> oh, car stopped. Interesting, no caution. So four litres per lap. Ten laps to go, so... Jesus, close to fence. Alright, now this pit entry. Alright. Back out. Got just, yeah, under nine laps to go. Come on. Oh, wow, that. Does not look too healthy that <laughs> McLaren Schmidt Peterson. Alrighty, out in 12th spot. Let's see if we can get a top 10. Let's go. 
Well, that was a very quick lap. Ooh, fast lap of the race. Six seconds behind the cars in front. Oh, no, it's too deep. That is, there's some weird bump in the track there. Bit of a glitch with this track mod, but if you hit it, it really screws up the bottom of the car. It makes you jolt to the complete other side of the track. Anyway, we have some positions to be gained here. It's not over yet. No, to be honest, today I have not been driving too well. I've been super inconsistent. I mean, the car is definitely quick enough tell by that lap time that I set just before. Uh, I just I struggle trusting this car, especially on a street circuit, let alone on a normal circuit. Alright, come on, let's see if we can pass two more of these guys before the end. Get a run up the inside. Oh, two in one. You take that some way, don't it? You up into eighth. It's been a good comeback. Alright, next car's nine seconds ahead. That's gonna be a bit of a stretch in five laps. Give it a go.
Oh, this frame rate's killing me. Come on. Alright, coming up to the last lap now, just not quite close enough to make any sort of attack on the car in front, so we're just going to cruise to the end. Uh, anyway, it's been a great fight back, I managed to get back inside the top 10 after being all the way down to like 20th, so I'll definitely take this, let's just get this thing to the finish line, we've still got one of our Penske teammates behind us. Oh. Lose the tire. I've really used every last bit of this Firestone rubber. Oop. There's actually a Pensy sandwich right now. Scott Dixon in the good old Ganassi special has just cleared off into the distance.
Alrighty. Eighth place finish around Detroit. Man, absolutely nailed the fuel as well. Look, one litre left. Holy moly. Man, I am absolutely sweating my nuts off. Jesus. I don't think I've ever sweat this much in a race in my life. Ah, oh, my days. Ah, oh, that was a hard one. Anytime you drive an Indy car, whether it be on iRacing or R Factor 2, it's always a mission. Jeez. Anyway. Thanks guys for tuning in. I hope you enjoyed it. Good little comeback there, but yeah, it would have been nice to start further up the front. I really need to nail the qualifying on this uh, whenever well, whenever I do the next uh, Indy car video. Alright guys, thanks for tuning in. Hope you enjoyed it. Like and subscribe, and until next time, I'll catch you guys later.